I'm trying to kill you with a boulder. Stand still. No, don't land on his head. Hi, ho, Bigglesworth. Hello and welcome to Hi Ho Bigglesworth. My name's Timothy Babblehump and this is Landstalker. So last time I got tasked with uh, going to the Tower of Myrrh to defeat the evil wizard, who is also called Myrrh. Obviously, it's, it's his tower, so it's Myrrh's tower, yeah? Makes sense. And I was gonna go there. But when I came- Shut up, priest. When I came to the, to the church to save it, I noticed there's a bunch of people just hanging around here. So first I'm gonna find out what the fuck's going on here. To get the armlet is to prove oneself worthy to enter the tower. So I have to get an armlet to go into the tower. Okay. You're going to the tower too? How bold you guys are! Okay. It's said that the underground monsters are much more cunning than us. If they were more cunning than you, then they wouldn't be forced to live underground and let you just live in your city up here. They would have invaded. They would have beat you. Zack and Dexter, they went down to the crypt some time ago. Okay, so they're, they're way ahead of me. Apparently I have to go to a crypt to get an armlet to go into the tower. Okay, I wasn't told this. When, when, when would I have been told this? I don't remember anyone mentioning this. I just heard some horrible screams and my ears playing tricks on me. I don't know, maybe they're, they're both dead. Fine, because obviously I'm going to get the armlet first. Otherwise, what's the point in this quest? Hello. Ah, welcome to Mer the Mercator Champion Motel. Heroes check in, but they don't check out. Well, <laughs> there it is. The underground crypt. What are you waiting for? Okay, fine. Let's go to the underground crypt and get this fucking armlet that I wasn't told about. Was I told about? I don't remember anyone mentioning that. Fucking hell, it's creepy in here. Okay, let's, let's just go through this little door. And, uh, up here, um, Guardian of the Undead. Okay. Riddler from the Underworld puts you to the test, so keep your wits unfurled and give your sword a rest. <laughs> here comes another victim. Are you going to enter this hall of the undead at all costs? Yes. Brave boy, you have to solve eight riddles in eight rooms. If you correctly solve the riddle for the room, the torch will go out. You can go to the other side of the river when all eight riddles are solved. But if you fail, <laughs> it'll be the end of your life. Okay, so now I've got to do fucking puzzles. Okay, so... Uh, Right. Riddler, um, is this a riddle? Is this a riddle? There's two torches in here. He said something about giving your sword a rest so you can't use your sword. But to interact with stuff, I have to swing my sword. See? Well, it doesn't do it there. But if I wanted to interact with this, I have to press the sword button. I don't know. Okay, let, let's just go to another room. And calmly... Okay, I, I, I'm guessing all the riddle rooms have this on the outside. Yeah? Let's read it. What, what does it say? Room one, Betty Ross. Okay, that, that, that does not help me with the riddle. What's the riddle? Okay, hold on. Betty Ross, 226 to 291. Okay. Betty stitched a border, yellow, red, and white. If everything's in order, everything's all right. Okay, yellow, red, and white. Okay, so that's the yellow one. Is it? That's the red one, that's white. No, okay. Well, I, none of them were red! The yellow, red, and white. If everything's in order, everything's alright. So obviously I have to kill them. The yellow one, the red one, and then the white one. None of them were red! But I killed this one second last time. Fucking kill the fucker! Okay, I'm guessing this one's red. It's purple and yellow. I don't know. Okay, and then white. Did we solve the puzzle? No, we didn't! What the hell? Just try every possible order. And then that one. And then like, this is what I did the first time. I got an e-keek, yay! But it, it didn't solve the riddle though! Okay, so this is the last possible order I can kill him in. If this isn't right, then I have no idea what to do. Okay, Betty stitched the body, yellow, red, and white. If everything's in order, everything's all right. Yeah, so that... Fucking... <sighs> the sword keeps hitting on the wall. Okay. There we go. Why was that the order? Why then purple or yellow and then yellow or brown? Uh, room two, Ruby Silent. Okay. Ruby Silent, I guess I have to make no noise. Ruby Silent 2020 to 20, 
220 to 280. Ruby lived in silence. She never made a sound, nor acted out of violence till they put her in the ground. Okay, so don't attack. Don't, don't make a noise. Nothing's happening. Nothing's happening. Okay, it said till they put her in the ground. Do I have to let them kill me? This is better be the answer to the riddle, because I don't want to be dying and wasting ikigs. Did I solve it? No! What was I supposed to do then? I'm not making any sounds. No. Okay, okay, I just had to let them hit me twice without moving, without doing anything. And then it worked, yeah. That was, that was an actual riddle. The first one wasn't, it made no sense. It made no fucking sense at all. Right, room three, Jack Skywalker. Okay. Jack Skywalker. Jack Skywalker, 199 to 266. Jackie could intuit the way to float on air, and if you'll just hop to it, he may still be walking there. So, you just jump, jump, keep jumping. I can't, I can't walk around the edge of the room. I can't go right up to the, that edge of the room. Okay. There we go, I'm walking on air. I'm, uh, uh, I'm up, I'm up, I'm up somewhere. There we go, I did it, I, I did it, yeah. Okay, there was invisible platforms. I, I knew it. Well, I suspected it. Dirk the Dark, no, I, I want to do him in order. So let's go, let's go along here. I'm guessing room four is here. Room four, Maria Hysterica. Maria Hysterica? Okay, there's a boulder. Maria Hysterica, 202 to 276. Maria was a jealous wife. She threw the pots and pans. I think she even took a life with a boulder in her hands. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna throw the boulder at him. What the fuck are you supposed to throw the boulder at him? Yeah, did, did that not kill it? Well, that didn't work because it died. Because I hit it with a sword. Because I was trying to pick up the boulder, which landed on its head. I'm trying to kill you with a boulder. Stand still. No, don't land on his head. I... There we go. I killed it. Oi. 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 Why didn't I... So... I didn't... I threw the boulder. I killed it with the boulder. But it didn't work. It didn't fucking work. What the hell? How come that worked? It didn't work the other time. <sighs> Fine. Room five, Jim Bright. Okay. What do you do, Jim Bright? Jim Bright, 186 to 222. Do I have to read their gravestones? I don't know. Jimmy loved to camp beside a shining light. Reading books by a lamp is how he got so bright. Okay. Oh, for fuck's sake! What the fuck? Jimmy loved to camp beside a shining light. Reading books by a lamp is how he got so bright. I'm gonna go buy some more e-geeks while I try and puzzle that one out. Okay. If I step on that, the monsters fall on my head. So does that mean I do it wrong? But what else am I supposed to do? Something, it's something to do with the, these torches, isn't it? Because they're bright. They're, they're the lights. I can't push them. I can't do anything. I, I can pick up the switch. Okay. Do I have to... If I, if I, if I, if, if I put the switch down there. Ah. Uh, okay. That didn't work. Is that... If I put it, like, right next to it, so it's just touching it. Yeah, that, that, that worked, okay. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> uh, I'm, not, I'm not quite getting these riddles. Room 6, Larson E. I have to steal something, don't I? Clearly. Larson E, 177 to 246. Larson E had a zeal for things that were not his, but he found that if you steal, you're sure to fail the quiz. Okay, don't steal. Don't steal. Don't open the treasure chests. Just stand here and don't open them treasure chests. Jump on the treasure chests, use them to reach the top. You can't, you can't walk on the top bit. Okay, fine. I'm not gonna open them. There we go. Now can I open them? Alas, it was empty. Alas, it was empty. Oh, fucking hell. 
and you get attacked by monsters if you try and steal from them. If they're all empty, I was hoping I'd get a livestock out of one of them, but fine, fine. Two more puzzles left. Room 7, Dirk the Dark. It's gonna be dark. Is it? I don't know. Dirk the Dark, 222 to 249. He was quite young, wasn't he? Murdering Dirk was aboard as his victims piled high. Yet he who lives by the sword will surely die by it. What am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to just kill the dark one? That's a bit racist, isn't it? Oh, fucking hell. How am I supposed to just kill one of these bastards? They're all coming at me. Okay. Yes! I solved it! All you had to do is be racist. <laughs> Fine. Roommate Houdini. Houdini. I have to escape. Houdini, 77 to 125. He's the, he's the, he's, he was the earliest born out of all these. Here lies Houdini, magician without peer. His body was so skinny, he'd turn then disappear. Okay, what does that mean? Do I have to hide? Because you have to disappear. You can still see me. Oh no, no! Okay, uh, the box was important, was it? I don't know, I don't even understand this riddle! Okay, good day. Okay, I'm up here. I couldn't get up here on the other ones. But that doesn't change anything! Oh, oh! Okay, I, I found... This is just a bit where you can just walk in. I, I solved all of the riddles! Yes! Okay. So, hello, mummy! <laughs> there are still more riddles to solve over there. Do you really want to go across the river? Okay, <laughs> I'll take you to Gehenna. What? Fine. So there's more riddles. That's, that's a bit evil, isn't it? <laughs> so long. More riddles. This is fucking ridiculous. Where the hell am I now? I'm just going to walk over here and have a look over here. Because I, I saw there were more riddles there. There was a door with more riddles. Aha! I found a livestock! Okay, so. There's, there's only one room. Okay, let's read it. Room 9. Dead and End. Okay. I know. Gee, how do you get here so early? I'll never let you in. That treasure's mine. What does it say? Got it. So long, sucker. <laughs> He's taking a while to die. <laughs> no! Ah, okay. Dead and end. 199 to 276. When your heart's desire is on a distant shore, it takes a ball of fire to open up the door. I don't want to go near the door. I don't want to get attacked by a ball of fire. I'm just going to have to go for it, aren't I? Ah! Okay, it sort of hit me. Okay, I, I think I need to get it to hit the door. Yeah? Come on, come at me. It hit the door. Fine. I was going to try and jump over it, but fucking hell, it was much too fast. Right. Hello, mummy. Mmm, bright boy brains. Love to eat them up every day, yum. <laughs> fuck, fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Can you fuck off, please? I, I, what the hell killed me? I can't, I can't hurt him. What's hurting me? What's killing me? Fucking hell, I've got to solve all them riddles again now, don't I? Go on, hit the door, hit the door, hit the door, hit the door. There we go, it hit the door, fine. Right, so this mummy. I'm going to try and read the things. What does it say? What does it say? I'm trying to read that fucking shit. Come on, read... Why? I'm getting hit by nothing. Why is nothing hitting me? Come on. Evil is beside itself with anger aimed at thee. But if you step aside with stealth, the truth will set you free. What does that mean? Evil's beside itself. That means it. The, it's not the mummy I'm supposed to attack. There's an invisible thing that's near it. That Yeah. Okay, there's something near it. To the side of it that's fucking attacking me. Come on. 
Yeah, there we go. Okay, I get it now. If I just keep attacking, every time it comes up here, I'm going to hit it. Okay. Yeah, that's why I was getting hit by nothing. I wasn't... The, the mummy can't hurt me. It's the thing to the side of the mummy that hurts me. Can you just die, please? Okay, uh, let's just walk a bit closer. There we go. I killed it. Yeah, and, and can can I get my prize now? The armlet! Yes! I found the armlet. Okay, where where was um what's his name? Zack? Yeah, Zack. Where where where's Zack? Did he die in, in the riddles? I don't, I don't know. Can can I go back? Hello? Impossible! How is it you came back alive? Are you going back to town? Come on! Yeah. I have to I have to go on this boat ride with with a with a mummy that hates me because I solved the riddles. I can see there's something about you. I don't know what it is. Okay. Fine. I don't care. <laughs> I really don't care. I, I got the armlet. So next time we can go and kill the wizard. We can go and defeat that wizard. Yeah. <laughs> it was good practice for you, wasn't it? <laughs> no, it wasn't. It was evil. It, that was evil. Is that the armlet? You really did it? Gee. If you were strong and smart enough to get the armlet, Mur should be no problem for you. Mur's probably going to murder me. Lots. Yeah. So the next time we'll go to the tower and we'll face off with Mur. Yeah. So I've been Timothy Babelham. This has been Landstalker. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Fucking hell. That, that, th them puzzles were evil. Evil puzzles.